about set to kick off here, and it's not a home game for either of these teams. And now it's time for the coin toss, and it's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Both teams are lining up for the kickoff, and we're just about set to get this one underway. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Brought down at the 19. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Fires out to his wideout. Tackle made at the 42-yard line. This isn't even the best example, but I'm going to tell you something. This young man is really getting better at running his routes, which is a truly underrated quality these days. And they make the stop around the 44-yard line. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counterplay. The blocking was great up front, and the tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. They'll bring him down at about the 35. And now he's got room to run. He makes his way out to about the 25. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. Boy, the defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack, but somehow he's able to throw the ball away. Throws quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. You know, he had his receiver open. He just put too much on that football. He's got to find a little bit more touch next time. Third down, and they need to get it to the 15. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. It looked like they caught the quarterback by surprise. Well, that's a great call by the defensive coordinator. They send him off the corner, and he just uses his speed to get the sack. Arizona State is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and he just drilled it from long range. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. They'll bring him down at the 23-yard line. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. The Hilltoppers saw one of their key guys go down earlier. Looks like he might be able to get back in the action. Tackled after a decent pickup. That makes it second and six. From their own 27-yard line, second down. Here's a run. Runs outside for a nice game. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 36. He's scrambling. He 
He's taken down at the 38-yard line. That'll bring up third and eight. They'll line it up again on third down. He's knocked out of bounds right around the 46-yard line. Wow, a long game, but still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt themselves by digging themselves into a hole on first and second down, so the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. We're set to get restarted as the offense looks to build on the success of their field goal on the last drive. Arizona State has a three-point lead. Caught open field. Tackle right around the 36-yard line. Number 22 on the tackle at the 36-yard line. My four, my four. That brings up second and nine. Makes it out to about the 49. Hey, kill, kill, kill. Three, five, three. He's at the 40. He dives and he'll be marked down. secondary just enough to allow for the receiver to come up with a nice gain that time. Good call. Throws complete. He's got space to work. Out of bounds at about the 17-yard line. First and goal. Well, we've got a player down, and let's hope that's nothing serious. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Well, as they take a look at that injury on the sideline, let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. Nice run, and he's brought down. Arizona State holds a field goal lead. He flicked his wrist and made the connection to his wide receiver. It looked to me that the defense was more worried about the quarterback scrambling, and that's why they just gave up that touchdown. He makes the PAT. An eight-play, 73-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. Brad, I thought that was a technical try. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. Excellent kick. They line up to kick this one away. And down he goes at the 19-yard line. Let's see if this drive has a more rewarding conclusion than their last, which ended with a punt. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. He gets sacked on the play. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Second and 15. Ball on the 14-yard line. We've played one quarter. The Sun Devils in front, 10-0. Back 
to the action now here in the second quarter. And he throws it away. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. They get to the quarterback, and now the ball is loose. Touchdown, ASU! Defensive touchdowns give teams such a big morale lift. This was a really nice play to grab the loose ball and take it the distance. And he hits the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This defense has everything. They kind of have that blue-collar, workman-like approach, but they also have a blend of tremendous speed to go along with that work ethic. And the better they play, they seem to feed off of it, and it continues throughout the whole ballgame. Well, let's see if the offense can make up for the misfortune they had just a few moments ago. I know as a quarterback, it's always hard to watch the defense score a touchdown on you. But it was always a reminder to take extra care of the football. And he has a huge game. And I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off. Ends up with a great run. From their own 42-yard line, first down. Down at the 43. That brings up second and nine. Larry, Larry. Mike, two. Rush, two. Rush, two. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Plays it out there, and it's caught. He's tackled at the 15. So after the big pass play, we've got a first down. it out to maybe the 13-yard line. Call it a game of two yards. That'll make it second to seven. Man left, man left. Three down, three down. Here we go. Green 19. Run, 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 run. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. That's good for a game of 12 yards. It's first down, and they come to the line with a first and goal. Super play to time the hit just right on what looked like a sure touchdown. He really laid some lumber there. Here's the eighth play of the series. They line up in the jumbo set. Touchdown, Hilltopper. Tacks on the extra point. An eight play, 76 yard drive, and the result, seven points. The score now, 17 7. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20, 
And he's tackled at the 21-yard line. Arizona State's offense came out of the gate like gangbusters, but they have slowed things down now. I just don't sense the same energy from this team that we saw early in the game when they just came out and they were ready and excited. It seems that they've kind of let their foot off the accelerator, and now they're opening up an opportunity for this team to get back into this game and maybe take the lead. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. for the sack. Perfect time to call the blitz. He took a bit of a chance, but it paid off by the linebacker being able to get through there, shoot the gap, and get to the quarterback. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. <laughs> Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And down he goes at the 33. He heaves it deep. Almost intercepted. So the stop there on third and long, and that's going to bring up a punting situation. It's a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. This offense just torched the defense through the air with a great passing attack on their last drive. Great passing was the key for the offense the last time they had the ball. They were able to pick apart the defense and get down the field for a touchdown. Steps out of bounds at the 41-yard line. A five-yard gain. Not a bad play. They gained five yards out of it. And they keep moving the defense back. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Here's the give. They go to the left for a nice game. That's good for a gain of four yards. That'll make it third and one. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. So he got enough for the first down there. Yep, nice call to run the ball there on third down. I like it. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 50. Screen pass. He's got his half back. Very clutch tackle there because this kid had some space. It's great to put the ball in his hands and let him go to work. Big, big gain right there. They go to the screen here, and the halfback's got it. Touchdown, Western Kentucky. They decided to go to the running back on that touchdown pass. Just a nice job by the quarterback of showing great patience here, going through his progressions, finally finding the back to get into the end zone. The draw within a field goal. And he converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 29-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Arizona State is up a field goal. Passes to the back, incomplete. From their own 29-yard line, second down. Fires 
quick to an open man. He dropped it. Quick throw. He's to the 40. He's out of bounds at about the 47-yard line. Impressive gain there by the do-it-all back. From their own 47-yard line, first down. quickly to the tailback and he's tackled right around the 42 yard line now well, the quarterback's able to find a soft spot in the defense and he threw an accurate ball for a solid pickup complete brought down nothing doing the sun devils call a timeout that's their second of the half from the 40 yard line it's second down to the 20. Makes it to the 22-yard line. Well, the offense heading back out onto the field after that kick, hoping to turn this drive into another touchdown. If you can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline, though. I don't know if they can stop the passing attack, but they need to at least be able to slow it down. Oh, a big hit there to stop him. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. So at the end of the half, Arizona State leads 24-14. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Well, as an iconic figure once said, that escalated quickly. Got away a little bit from this team that's supposed to be in control of the game, and now suddenly they aren't. And, David, we, we say this every week. We say this team has to go into the locker room, make some adjustments. They have to change things, have to give a big speech. What's the most important, the most impactful thing that this team could do in the second half to turn this game around? Well, I think you, you come into half and you do have those all those great speeches and you, you know, the coaches do try to get you fired up, but then you realize that you just got to execute. And, and I think you don't come in as, as a favorite, as a more talented team and panic, and that's something that you can't do. So I think the second half, you come out and you try to get some positive things going. You try to get some first downs. Stop thinking about getting the 14 points back right away. Start putting drives together. Then you get points. Then you're down, you know, seven points or you're down one score. You get it more manageable. But listen, when you're the more talented team, you don't have to panic. And I think the coaches tell you, listen, nothing's changed. The schedule is going to stay the same. We just got to make more plays, less mistakes in the second half. Just about time to start the second half. What, what do you think Herb Street's first point of analysis will be? Uh, I don't know, something to do with quarterback play, I'm sure. I mean, we've got to hear that stuff all the time. It's all about the quarterbacks. Brad and Kirk ready for the second half.
All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. Tackle made at the 32. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He makes it to the 35-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. From their own 35-yard line, second down. He's going to try and scramble. Tackle at the 48-yard line. That's a gain of 13 on the way. First down. Three down, three down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Stop! 180! And he hits him hard at the 36. First and ten, ball on the 36. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Quick pass, man open, and he dropped it. it out to about the 26. That makes it first and ten. From the 26 yard line. First down. Caught with room to work. They'll bring him down at the 18. Number 13 wins his down at the 18 yard line. That makes it second and two. Too little, Captain. Like two. And off on the draw. He makes it to the 18-yard line. No game on the play. That'll bring up third and two. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Three down, three down. Four is the right. Three, set. Three, 95. Three, 95. And they make the stop around the 15-yard line. From the 15-yard line, it's first down. Tackled after decent pickup. Here's play number 10 on the drive. The seven yard line. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. Touchdown, Hill Tapper. Gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he scored earlier. Well, this young man is having a great individual day. But some more of these guys on his team need to start doing the same if they want to get back into the game. Here's the extra point to draw within three points. He splits the uprights with the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 29. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. Arizona State has a three-point lead.
tackle after a decent run up the gut. Slings it. He's taken down at the 47. Shoved out of bounds around the 43 yard line. Got it, but he's going to lose yards here. Ball on the 39-yard line. Arizona State holds a field goal lead. Makes it to the 21. to try to single out just one of them to stop. He makes the PAT. So a nine-play, 71-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. So our score... 31-21. He's to the 20. That was a great hit. He wasn't getting away from that one. And offense is back on the field after running the ball very well on their last drive. This offensive line really opened up some big gaps for the running back last time. And he's leveled at the 36-yard line. From their own 36-yard line, first down. He's tackled at the 42. So at the end of three, Arizona State leads 31-21. We're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Three down, three down. Mike 40, Mike 40. Ready. I got it, I got it. Makes it out to about the 50. From the 50. First down. Scrambling around. He's at the 40. And down he goes. Around the 36-yard line. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. 
Looking for his man, incomplete. You can't blame him for not hanging on to that pass. He got hit pretty hard. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. Play and he'll lose yards. The object was to sell the pass and then sneak by the defensive line with the run. The problem here was that the quarterback didn't sell the pass very well. Fires out to his receiver. Brought down at the 16-yard line. This guy is one of the most reliable receivers around. They needed a big play on third down, and he got it for them. This is the eighth play of this drive. Makes it out to maybe the 13-yard line. Second down, seven yards to go. Ball on the 13. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. This is the 10th play of the drive. Steps out of bounds at the 12. Looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. tries to buy some time. Slides down. I think they had to go for it given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. The offense just wasn't able to make a play. The defense was really clutch right there. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. He fights forward to about the 10. So the option keeper goes for about a yard. One thing about this linebacker over the years that separates him from the rest are his instincts and ability to make the play. That's a nice tackle by the senior. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Gains his way to the 19-yard line. You like to see a team having success like this running the football. It can really open up things for the offense. It's first and ten. Ball on the 19. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. The Hilltoppers use their second timeout. Run down after a nice run up the middle. The defense had a great opportunity there, and they let it go. This is an offense that's clearly working clock. They've got to get more aggressive defensively and attack the line of scrimmage to be able to slow down this offense from getting first down. He'll get it again. Decent run here, right side. From their own 34-yard line. Second down. Gets to about the 37-yard line. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Woo. I think everybody in the stadium felt that hit. He really laid some lumber there. He's got the corner. Good tackle there in space. And that's their third first down of the drive. The defense needs to figure out a way to stop them, or else they're going to have no problem putting points on the board. So the ball spotted right around midfield as they continue to move the ball on this drive. Takes a knee. We're at play number nine of this current drive. And off 
offensive battle to the very end. 31-21, Sun Devil. So that wraps things up for us, for EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.